As our journey continues through Florida, we find ourselves swimming alone in a spring that was populated with the record-breaking 729 manatees earlier this year. We found that the natural springs are the best way to cool down from the humid Florida climate, so join us as we explore Blue Spring State Park, and welcome to Living Large Camping. State Park number two. Hey everybody and welcome back to Living Large Camping. We just pulled into our spot here at Blue Springs State Park here outside of Orlando, Florida. It looks like a gorgeous area and we are just so excited to have a great day at camp. We are so excited. I think we're gonna check out the spring tomorrow, but today we're gonna walk around the campground check it all out and show you guys what we see. When we looked up where to stay in Florida, this one was recommended again and again. So we are very lucky that we were able to score one night here. So we can't wait to take you guys along. It's not too hot right now, but we have the camper plugged in. That way the fridge runs more efficiently. And I think it's time to go walk the camp loop. Let's do it. But first things first, bug spray. We need lots of it. We're almost done walking the second loop here in this campground. We've seen two other truck campers. There's a Capri and then an old adventurer. A um, couple big motor coaches that are kind of tucked way yeah, back I in these spots. Yeah, I don't know how they did it. Skilled. <laughs> and then decent number of trailers and a lot of tents. Probably getting close to the end of tent camping season, so I'm sure they're enjoying it while they can. Yeah, it's been nice. We've seen some fellow Lance campers, so that's also nice to see. <laughs> a great walk around the loop here at Blue Spring State Park. It's a really pretty area. They take great care of this park, but there is some rain coming and it should be here for about an hour. So we're gonna get some work done and just hang out inside for a minute while the rain comes and then we'll see you guys for cocktails and dinner. Sounds fantastic. See you guys in a bit. I think it's time for a beer. I'm already ahead of you. <laughs> <laughs> the rain hasn't really let up it's still sprinkling out there a little bit so we're gonna cook dinner inside tonight and we're going super simple we ended up at a restaurant called puddle jumpers earlier and we had some leftover mahi mahi so we are gonna cook that tonight with some lettuce wraps we've got a little bit of onion diced some red pepper and then some hot rotel and we're gonna do that in a lettuce wrap and it'll be a great dinner Okay, change of plans, our lettuce is frozen, so we are going to get the quinoa boiling and do quinoa with fish, onion, and peppers, and rotel. Perfect alternative.
our second plan worked out just great. Just some easy leftovers. We needed to get rid of the quinoa anyway because we're trying to clear some space in our pantry. Yeah, we're gonna have a great dinner here and then we'll see you guys after. I think we're probably gonna try out the showers just to get the bug spray and the sunscreen off of us. So, we'll see you guys after dinner. Shower time. <laughs> this has been a long time coming. incredible the showers got very hot which was really nice <laughs> definitely needed a deep clean because all the bug spray that adds up that you use in florida and the sunscreen it just feels really nice to be able to shower and them being included in your park fees is really nice it just makes you kind of use them a little bit more than when you have to pay i give bathroom review a 10 out of 10 still still incredible <laughs> Back to camp we go. <laughs> it is so nice to be able to crawl in the bed clean, especially because we're continuously lathering up with sunscreen and bug spray right now. So we are gonna enjoy some good rest tonight and I think we're gonna go check out the springs tomorrow. So we'll pick you guys back up in the morning. Good night everybody. favorite times of the day because it's cool enough in here to turn both the fans off and it just means pure silence which we don't get very often because the heat right now makes us constantly run both fans and it's fine but it gets tiring after a while. to walk to the campground and then I think we're going to check out the springs nearby. I think just walk to them because they're pretty close and see what they're all about. <laughs> Come on, Mike. We are headed to the springs. They have a very nice paved trail from the campground to the springs. Not really sure how far it is, but we're gonna <laughs> walk it and see where it leads us. We had to leave Barkley in the camper, but the fans are on, so he's staying cool and dry while we check out the springs. So we're very excited. See what they're like. Here we go. Okay, wow, that walk was so short. Definitely <laughs> less than a quarter mile. But we have got here. It doesn't look too busy yet, so hopefully that's true whenever we actually get down to the water. <laughs> wow. always hesitant when the water is a little bit chilly so it might take me a little bit to get in but I'll pass the camera off to Connor. <laughs>
once again having a colder morning here makes it great for us because <laughs> we get this whole place to ourselves although it does mean we can't swim for very long just because it's <laughs> pretty chilly it's pretty chilly <laughs> i think we're gonna dry off and maybe just kind of walk around this area and see what else they have to offer So we walked over here on this trail to the actual Blue Springs area. There are a couple scuba divers training or just diving over here, I guess. <laughs> it's really pretty, though. It is gorgeous. The water is crystal clear, kind of a green, aqua, beautiful. And it seems like some manatees hang out here sometimes, so maybe we'll see one. Those are the best wraps. They are in the freezer section. They don't fall apart. Just best gluten-free wraps ever. Nice easy lunch, but it was good enough for right now. We do have to be out of this park at one and it's about 12.15. So we're gonna get the camper all packed up and then we're gonna head into town to upload a video for you guys. And then we'll be making our way to our next state park, which you will see in the next video. Well, that's going to do it for us this week, guys. I hope you enjoyed coming along with us as we explored Blue Spring State Park. I wish we could have spent more nights here because I think kayaking and doing more stuff around this area would have been really nice, yeah. but we didn't plan it very far in advance, so we took what we could get. Yeah, I am pretty shocked that we were even able to score one night. People said they book out a year in advance, so we are very thankful we got this spot. And like you said, they do have some trails and stuff like that, so it would have been cool to check those out. But we hope you guys enjoyed what we could show you, and hopefully we'll be back. If you're still here at the end of this video, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let us know that you like our adventures down here in Florida. Been really enjoying our time in this state. It hasn't been too hot yet, so we haven't been too miserable in the camper, yeah. but we've got some other fun things left to show you still before we leave, and we can't wait to share that with you. As always, thanks for watching. Hope you have a large day. Bye, guys. <laughs>